Hey guys, so I wanted to share with you today some natural deodorants that I have tried and kind of give you my review. So about three years ago, I was kind of like known for on my social media, the fact that I used um, toothpaste, a certain toothpaste as my natural deodorant. Um, and that was actually the first thing that got me to switch over to using natural deodorant because I had tried all the like chemical deodorants out there, even the ones that were like extra strength, clinical strength, like hyper chemicals. And I just, I felt like nothing I used would ever help me not stink. It was just like constantly, I couldn't get the stink to go away. And I thought anytime I had used natural deodorant, it only made it worse. So the very first thing I use for natural deodorant is this Thieves Denterone Plus. It's a Young Living um, essential oil toothpaste. Someone that I knew had told me that it worked great as a deodorant. And I was like, what in the world? And I would have never purchased it to try it as a deodorant because I wouldn't have believed it would work. Um, but I had some, so I was like, well, why not? So I would just use like a little pea-sized amount in each armpit. And honestly, this stuff works really, really good. And I probably used it for like two years. Um, um, and honestly, all the stink went away. I never smelled and I barely even sweat. The only thing is, is that this does have a little bit of sodium bicarbonate, which is baking soda um, in it. And I think that was part of what helped me not sweat and what made it work. Um, so then I had a friend tell me about this Schmidt's um, natural deodorant and this bergamot lime is my favorite scent um, but I started using this because it was easy because it was just in a stick and you could just rub it on you know if I use a toothpaste I got it on my fingers so this was a little bit better and I use this for about a year and I am telling you this stuff works like magic my husband loves this he still uses this um, but I didn't sweat at all ever. And if you know anything about the body, you're supposed to sweat. Like sweat lets the toxins out. And um, basically this, I think again, has um, sodium bicarbonate, which is the baking soda. And I think that baking soda must have just clogged my pores so much that I basically didn't sweat at all for a year, which I'm a major sweater. And the rest of my body, I sweat. And um, so I think eventually, like after using this for a year, my armpits just like exploded in a rash. It was so itchy, it was so dry, and there was nothing I could do no matter how much I washed my armpits or whatever. I, it took me about two weeks washing my armpits every day and I didn't even wear deodorant for those two weeks and I didn't even smell or sweat. Um, it was almost like my body needed to get it out of my pores and then the rash went away, everything calmed down, it was fine. And then I was kind of like, okay, well, I can't use this again. Um, Cause even then I, I tried it like once or twice and instantly my armpits would just like break out in a rash. So this stuff works great as long as you don't have an allergic reaction to it. And like I said, my husband uses it and it works great for him. Um, so then from there, I bought these two natural deodorants. Um, this Walita Citrus, it's a roll-on, and I really like the scent, um, but I just felt like I have to put it on several times a day. So if you don't sweat much and you don't have much natural body odor, this might work for you. It's really light, and like I said, the scent is good. It's just that it just wasn't quite enough for me. I also have tried this. Um, essential oil organic deodorant this is the citrus scent it's a little bit too much of a manly scent for me but I really liked just that you could spritz it on really quick and it was good to go as well however I still didn't feel like these were exactly what I was looking for so now per the recommendation of a good friend of mine I have settled on something that I think is gonna be my best fit um, this is the Nubian heritage honey and black seed 24-hour deodorant this stuff smells amazing it doesn't have um, sodium bicarbonate, so um, no baking soda. And so far, it says on here 24 hour deodorant. I can attest to the fact that it is a 24 hour deodorant. It really smells nice, it goes on really smooth, and it has a really strong scent that's just very fresh. And um, it, because you know, if you use um, like the regular deodorants, I feel like they're kind of like 
body odor and chemical scent. This is just really, really nice. It's almost as though you're wearing perfume or something. So this is kind of my favorite right now, the Honey and Black Seed. Um, I got it at Sprouts, but I'm sure that you can get it on Amazon. If you can, I'll check it out and then I'll put a link in my profile. Um, so you might check there first and see. Um, but anyhow, this is my favorite right now, the Honey and Black Seed. But like I said, this stuff works great. And if you can stand the baking soda, this is really amazing. So those are my reviews on the natural deodorants I've tried. I will say there's a few others I've tried in the mix, but they weren't even any good, not worth mentioning. So I hope this is helpful. If you have any questions, let me know because I um, was on the search for years and years for a natural deodorant that I liked and it took me a while to find these. So hope this helps.